What's happening there guys and welcome back to our channel. Channing Tatum has recently opened up about a project that he's been working on which unfortunately ended very badly. In this video, we're discussing the fact that Channing Tatum stopped watching Marvel movies because of this one thing. Number 5. Getting to play Gambit The Hollywood industry has many projects in production and planning at any given time. Since there are so many projects, it's a bit hard for them to settle down on the ones that should be made into a movie or end up being cancelled. One of the ways they decide this is by leaking some news about the project on social media and analyzing the reaction that fans have to it. A similar thing ended up happening with Channing Tatum. He was all set to play the role of Gambit in a 20th Century Fox movie. He recently sat down and talked about it in an interview. He mentioned that he was so excited by the prospect that he really wanted to play the character in the movie. As you might know, there's no movie dedicated to the character of Gambit and that's because this project got cancelled while in the planning phase. There are many reasons for this, so let's talk about some right now. It was a bit of a paradigm shift and we were trying to make something at a time and trying to do some different things and we just... I would be in anything that they, that they put up, I mean especially the Gambit, I've, I've been pretty... Number 4. Fan Reaction to the News as we mentioned previously, when studios are deciding which project to dedicate their resources to, they do multiple things. In the case of this Gambit project, they reportedly made posters and sketches of how the character would look like in the movie, and more importantly, how Channing Tatum would look like in the role. When these concept pictures reached some fans online, there was a sudden backlash against the studio for even considering Channing in this role. One of the reasons why this happened had to do with the fact that Magic Mike had just recently come out and so fans were of the thinking that there would be no way that such an actor would be suited to play a hero in a fictional world. We don't need to tell you, but that was obviously the wrong way to be thinking about things. Nonetheless, all these reactions reached the people making the movie and while it wasn't the main reason, it did contribute to the cancellation of the project. Number 3. Fox trying to rival Marvel. You might be thinking why Fox would be pursuing such movies in the first place and that had something to do with the fact that Marvel was gaining ground really quickly in the movie business. It was a clear signal to the studios that comic book movies could not only be made, they could also be really successful. Since Fox had already been making superhero movies for a long time before Marvel Studios entered the scene, they thought they could up their game by introducing new characters and giving them their own solo projects, a strategy that, by the way, has worked out really well for the MCU. This is why they were exploring the Gambit movie and what it could look like. Number 2. Disheartened by Events In the interview where Channing discussed all that went down regarding this movie, he said some things that made a lot of people empathize with him in his situation. He said that he'd been really excited for the role and that he had worked really hard to study the character as much as he could. He even added that discussion about this movie had been going on for months before its eventual cancellation. When the news finally broke that they had abandoned this project, it left him so disheartened that he couldn't watch any of the Marvel movies that were released after this debacle. That is a very painful thing to have gone through. Imagine putting in so much effort into a project only for having to be cancelled after a while. Channing is right to have felt the way he did and no one can even blame him for the way he reacted to the event. It was in the comics and you also have to give them something that they believe and that they're not expecting. Right, so. Number 1. Open to Future Roles While the story might be all doom and gloom right now, there's still hope for the future. During the interview, he said that while he had been devastated by what had happened, one thing that could give him a bit of closure and a path to reconciliation was the studio offering him the role again. He didn't exactly say it in those words, but the intention behind his message was vividly clear. He said that he was still open to doing comic book movies. Given how much love and support he has gotten on social media since then, it wouldn't surprise us if he were to actually appear in a future Marvel project. So these were some of the details of Channing Tatum not watching Marvel movies. Raising someone's hopes and then crushing them should be illegal, so here's hoping that he gets justice for what's been done to him. And this puts a lid on another awesome video which we hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, then let us know by hitting that like button. And if you want more content like this going forward, don't forget to subscribe to our channel as well as hit that bell icon. Until next time, take care and goodbye.